Well, congregation, our offering this morning is for the GEMS Club. That is uh, Girls Everywhere Meeting the Savior. Um, and it is wonderful that we are able to support them. They were not able to meet a whole lot this past year, but they did uh, get to meet a couple of times. And hopefully, Lord willing, they will be able to have a fantastic year upcoming in the fall. And uh, we, we just praise God for that and for whatever he will do with our girls and our boys. Uh, so please prayerfully consider how you will give to that ministry. And in terms of congregational prayer, just a, a couple of uh, uh, new things or updates. Uh, one, just a reminder to pray for uh, Ray and uh, his family, uh, particularly Ray's mom, as uh, her husband, Ray's dad, uh, passed away last Saturday, uh, I believe. Uh, and so please be in prayer for them as they uh, grieve. Um, I think one of the hardest things for many of us during this time uh, is having, uh, having to have a celebration of life or funeral services that are severely limited in terms of how many people can come. And uh, for Ray and their family, uh, that was limited to only 10 people, which is, uh, which is tough. So pray uh, for their comfort, but also pray that they will be able to continue uh, to celebrate the life that God gave to uh, Ray's dad and that he, he knew God and he is now with God, and that is good. Also, we ask that you would pray for Sue and uh, Jake. Uh, Sue has been diagnosed with cancer, um, and so we pray for her. She's also um, got very severely um, limited mobility right at the moment because the cancer is on her spine. Um, but, uh, but the prognosis, the, the outlook for her is very good. Um, so uh, be in prayer for her and for Jake and for the whole family. Um, be in prayer for the doctors and nurses, of course, and other healthcare workers. Uh, and, uh, and just in general, um, please be in prayer also for all of our frontline workers. Um, Gwyneth's, um, Gwyneth's parents had a um, close friend uh, who passed away just this week uh, from COVID. And we know that uh, the situation in some of our hospitals and ICUs is pretty dire at the moment. Um, so please be in prayer for all of that. Let us come to God in congregational prayer. Father in heaven, thank you so much for our GEMS Club. Uh, thank you so much that we can minister to uh, not only the girls of the people in our families, in our church con community, but also that we can minister to girls from throughout uh, the area, uh, through GEMS in normal times. Lord, we pray uh, that you will bless our GEMS leaders, that you will guide them and keep them, and that, Lord, if, if it is your will that we would be able to have a normal and full and wonderful uh, season next year, Lord, we pray that you will be with these girls. Uh, thank you so much that they were able to get together at least once or twice during the past uh, year or so, just to keep that connection a little bit. But in the meantime, oh God, we pray that you will bless these, our tithes and offerings too. Father, we pray as well, of course, that you will continue to be with all of those in our congregation uh, whom we have mentioned in previous weeks uh, who are either dealing with sickness or who are recovering from surgeries or who are uh, grieving losses in their families or who are struggling with uh, mental health uh, and emotional well-being. Father, we pray that you will be with each and every one and that you will comfort each and every one and that you will bring your healing in whatever way you choose to each and every one as well. Father, we pray in particular that you will be with Ray and Tina and their whole family as, um, as Ray grieves the passing of his father uh, last week. Lord, please comfort them. We pray also 
that you would be with Sue and Jake and their whole family as they take this journey of, uh, of supporting Sue uh, during this time of cancer. Uh, Lord, we pray that you will uh, be with doctors and nurses in, in, in their particular situation, but also, O oh God, that you would be with our, our frontline healthcare workers throughout this province, throughout this country, throughout this world, O oh God. Lord, we think particularly of, uh, of places like India, where they are literally having hundreds of thousands of cases every day. Um, Lord, we pray that you will, uh, you will be with them uh, and that you will guide them in this situation. Father, too, we pray that as we come to your scriptures, you would open our hearts and minds, that you would, uh, you would have us hear, uh, that we would hear what you would have us hear. We pray this all in Jesus' name.